Hey everyone, and welcome back to part 18, yes, part 18 of Let's Get to Know Sunset Valley. <laughs> I always like get confused between Sunset Ties and Sunset Valley, but this is part 18 of Let's Get to Know Sunset Valley. We're still with the Bunch family. Lisa is currently pregnant. Oh my gosh. Um, but it's really early in the morning and they're pretty much just getting ready for school. Nothing crazy or out of the ordinary except for everything's broke I think the kids just keep doing that I don't know why they keep doing that but they pretty much hate each other it's so sad but whatever we are gonna have to get someone on to fix the sink and stuff because that noise really really bothers me but I do want to check up on Lisa because she's pregnant um she's still asleep I don't know if she's gonna make it to school I'll probably just have her skip school. Well, maybe not, because look at her grade. It's really bad. Um, because, like, that's just, I don't know. <laughs> I feel like she, if she goes to school, all the kids will make fun of her and stuff. I can't tell if, like, her body's growing or not. Okay, so it is. So she's getting more and more pregnant. Um... That's just crazy. I've actually never had a teen. Oh, girl, you're standing in your nightstand. I've actually never, ever had a teen pregnancy in my game, so this is just kind of weird for me. And, of course, the parents are still out of town, and she has yet to tell her parents that they're going to be grandparents. Like, yep, left that detail out. She actually wants to talk to Parker, though, which is really cool because that's who I wanted her to be with. So, it's pretty cool that she actually wants to talk to him. Is this any good? Yeah, that's still good. I'll put that away. And, and as I mentioned before, on giving their house a makeover, I, I'll probably end up doing that this part. Um, yeah. That's probably what's gonna happen. I pretty much just make up what's, like, what I'm gonna do on the fly, like, as I'm recording, I just, like, just make it up as I go. Okay, dude, what is wrong with your hair? Okay, that's much better. That was straight. So, I mean, I guess the kids are pretty much just going to go to school and nothing else. And I will kind of revamp their house. I don't know. Oh, the winter festival is here. That's fun. And it's snowing. It's so pretty. Alright, so the bus is here. I'm going to go ahead and send Lisa because her grade is so bad. She's going to have to go and probably get questioned how she got so pregnant overnight or over the weekend. Like, girl, you got you got six months pregnant over the weekend. <laughs> but, you know, that should be fun. Her grade is poop, so she's probably going to need to work on that while she's at school. Look at the snow. It's so cute not cute it's pretty it's beautiful it's beautiful I'm sorry if you start to hear thunder or anything it's currently raining and kind of storming outside which is a really good thing I love the rain dude a ghost just put mail in the mailbox that's cool um Ethan oh there's the mailman love how you just pop up out of nowhere Alma Ethan all right, he is on his way. So what I'm pretty much going to do is redo their house. And I'm going to do it off camera because I don't really like renovating on camera. I know some people enjoy making videos like that. But um, since I have just kind of a really... Like, I'm playing The Sims 3 in a laptop, and you can tell I do get lag sometimes. I mean, it runs okay. It's not the best. I don't have some amazing PC to handle everything, but, you know, it works for what I need. I don't like to record me building and stuff because fraps and recording and, like, doing build by mode all at the same time. For some reason, it really, really lags. Build by mode really, really, really lags whenever I'm recording. So, basically, long story short, I'm going to do it off camera and then I will 
come back and show you guys and give you the little tour so stay tuned for that all right so I did a few things to the house I actually ran out of money I only have nine hundred and ten dollars now which kind of sucks but um I did what I could and I will just go ahead and show you so first of all I fixed the master bedroom a little bit I mean it's missing a lot of furniture like there's no night tables and there's not a dresser but I kind of saved money so I can push it further and go try to do the rest of the house and of course I redid their bathroom I think it looks so much better um I hate like colored appliances they need to be white or black or brown but I don't like the whole blue appliances thing but okay so in the kitchen I redid it yep it's just kitchen and then I put the ice cream maker that life simmer gifted me <laughs> thanks girl um and I replaced the dining table I also did all the wallpapers I changed them to blue yeah <laughs> and then I didn't touch the living room because I ran out of money um their bathroom this wallpaper seriously needs to be changed um so then the kids room I gave them bunk beds and this beanbag chair and a TV, rearranged the room a little bit and then I worked a little bit on Lisa's room. I changed it to more purpley theme and I did out of cribs and she has a baby coming then I mean that's where she's going to have to keep it. Um, there's really nowhere else to put it. It's going to wake her up in the middle of the night but there's nowhere else for me to put it. Over here in the corner is her dressing area and then I put this really cute Eiffel Tower and this custom content picture frame or whatever is up there and these pictures and makeup and yeah so and that's all I got to do I totally ran out of money which sucks a lot but what are you gonna do about it <laughs> nothing so since no one is going to be home I'm going to have to pick up when the children get out of school or I don't actually know when they're coming home. Either or, when somebody gets home and is playable, then I will pick up then. Right, so pile of permission slips. Darlene Bunch needs to take a massive stack of permission slips to the city hall. Um, this needs to happen quickly. So she'll have to do that after school. Also, a formal dance is happening soon. It's going to be Thursday at 6 p.m. So today's Monday. Um, I don't know if both the teenagers are going to be going to that, but maybe. After school employment, your school's work study program doesn't have time to find a job for you, so they like you to go out and get a part-time job on your own. Get a part-time job in town to improve your school imp the school performance. We'll do that as well. Um, all the teenagers in household are taking a field trip tomorrow to the police department. That's great. Oh my god, there's so many opportunities. Um, and Arlo needs to go to a free game at the stadium to receive a boost in his performance. So, everybody wins. Everybody can do that. So, it looks like Ethan and Lisa are going to head home. Okay. I wonder when the parents are going to get home. I honestly, I mean, I really don't know. I would think, like, tonight. Maybe, but they're riding the bus home. I don't know what else to do with them. Look, there's other kids in here. What? That is so cool. There's only like three kids though. So, does that mean there's only three teenagers in the whole town? That's crazy. So Lisa's in here and then he's sitting next to some other chick. I don't know who she is, but that's interesting. 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 Okay, what? Oh, I guess she's, that's why she came home with us. So, Darlene Bunch would like to go over to Kaylin Landrex after school. That's cool, so we don't have to deal with her. Lisa's in a bad mood because she is a pregnant lady. Um, Ethan is going to go ahead and call the repair technician because I really don't want to deal with all this broken stuff. Hopefully he actually fixes stuff. Is she going to fix it for us? Oh, she ran straight for the ice cream. Look, I've never had a Sim use this before. Oh my god, I love Life Simmer. <laughs> so cute. 
So I guess Lisa is just going to go upstairs and kind of nap. No, don't. You're not going to have some ice cream. You're going to take a nap, hun. You're super angry. And when you wake up, you can have dinner. And Ethan, holy moly, here he's going to have some ice cream too. Ooh, sherbet. Perfect. Oh, girl, that outfit. Mm -mm. Strut it. <laughs> Um, uh, well, I don't know what to do with Mr. Ethan here. He's the only one I can do something with. The house looks a freaking mess, and when the adults get home, they're just gonna be like, WTF. Let's look at Darlene. She's going to Kaylin's house. Like, we've been here before, guys. Let's check up on our old friends. Hello? House? <laughs> we've totally been here. Let's be friends. Friendly introduction, y'all guys. You don't even know each other and you're going to her house. That is so weird. Oh my god. Go introduce yourself, girl. I kind of want to take a look around. I mean, obviously nothing is going to have changed because... That's something that's just so annoying to me that they can't change the rooms by themselves. I still really love this room. Eh. I used the same bed. That's funny. Listen to complaint. You know what? Shut up. We're not even, like, close to you. Shut up. Let's just chat with her. Try to spice the conversation. Say her house is nice. And get to know her. Arlo is in a really bad mood, so he's taking he's taking a shower with his hat on, which, I mean, not judging him or anything. What in the world is he doing in his parents' bed? He, like, thinks he owns a place. Wait. Oh, no, that's his bed upstairs. What? A oh, I thought he was just going to walk in on poor Arlo. So Ethan needs to make some... Wouldn't it be dinner? He needs to make some dinner for his family, and I'm thinking mac and cheese. Mac and cheese for the win. Come on. Arlo, what are we going to do with you? How about you just come outside and play? Like, make a snowman, bro. Make a snowman. Do you want to build a snow? <laughs> oh, cute. He wants to have a slumber party. Isn't that kind of a girl thing? Maybe not. Maybe I'm just cray cray. Oops. Okay. Do you want to build snowman? <laughs> Aw, how cute. When in the world are the parents coming home? I'm so done with them taking care of the house because they obviously can't. So she wake now, she's gonna have herself some ice cream. She's like, you know what? I can't wait for dinner. I'm having me some sherbet. Hell yes. Look at that, it just like plops it. Oh, that is so cool. That is so stinking cool. <laughs> Dude, create new flavor. She's going to stand there and nom that. She is going to nom that. All right. So I think it's time that I can't remember if she's ever told VJ if she's pregnant or not. But I definitely think it's time for her to say something. Just make sure that he kind of knows what's up. Where in the world is this house? You know, I totally forgot. I think it's like the next one over. Scoop. Here. Yep. And he's not home. So, she's going to have to, like, invite him out, pretty sure. BJ, where are you? Um, I'm going to have her just invite him over, because she's not really in a good enough mood to go out somewhere. He's still making, he, like, sucks at this. 
All right, so maybe she'll even pop tonight and BJ will end up taking her to the hospital. I don't know. Ethan made a snowman. Let's check it out. Ah, how cute. It's a classic one. That is super cute. You know what? She's probably going to give birth to this baby before her parents even get home. And then that'll be even more awkward. Like, sorry parents, while you're gone, I got pregnant and had a baby. <laughs> that would be just super shock. Alright, everybody's having the ice cream. I wish you would eat, like, actually eat. She's still hanging out with Kaylin, which is cool and all, but she kind of needs to go drop off the permission slips and get that done. Ethan, hi. No, don't go to bed. You need something to eat. Come eat. What? Who the heck did this? Who did this? That is disgusting. <laughs> Arlo, you cannot walk around and just destroy everything like that. Who in the... Oh, it's VJ. It is VJ. She went to bed. Alright, wake up and we're gonna come talk to him. Maybe. If you get up. Invite inside. Come on. Dude, how slow can a pregnant lady go? How slow can a pregnant lady go? How slow can a pregnant lady go? Hello. Okay. She's coming. Slowly, but surely. <coughs> Alright, now you can head home. Her little baby bump is actually the most cutest thing. Alright, so now he's inside. You need to tell him you're pregnant if he can't already see that, which <laughs> he would have to be really dumb not to. He's eating like stinky ice cream. Like who? Who did that? He's just like congrats. Like no, not congrats. Like this is your child. Um, the adults are returning in two hours. Make sure the house is clean. Oh my god. I feel like she's gonna ask him to sleep over because I think she's gonna have her baby tonight, which is gonna be pretty dramatic because her parents are getting home. So the house needs to be clean. He needs to clean this out. Ma what else can be done? What else can be done? He needs to mop this up. Alright, so if you're just gonna stay the night, that way maybe he can be here when the baby comes and help her out. <laughs> Alright, so hopefully things are clean. She needs to get out, clean the toilet, mop the puddle. Like, we gotta hurry. The rents are coming home. We gotta clean. I don't think there's... Oh, yep. Okay, well, I'm gonna make her come and clean this. Mop this. Alright, everybody's put to work. Everybody is put... To work. Come up that puddle. That way it'll go faster. Perfection. Everything is clean. Sorta. Sorta. <laughs> We're getting there. I still hear something like spewing though. It's up here. Gosh dang it, the repairman didn't even get up here. Oh, so frustrating. Whatever. Not my bathroom. I'm kind of excited for the parents to come home. This is going to be really awkward when they find out their daughter is like eight, nine months pregnant. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh, I need to fix 
this real fast. The wallpaper doesn't match the upstairs area. Okay. I think we're good now. Okay. <laughs> we're good. I'm sorry. OCD takes over sometimes. Please clean that. That is disgusting. Oh, they're home. Look, they're on their way home. Actually, are they... What? I hear Judy giggling. Is that her name? Judy Judy with a big fat booty. Okay, what is going on? Are you guys gonna, like, come home? I think we're waiting on Judy. Hello. <coughs> Hello? Judy? <laughs> I'm gonna just reset her. Oh, no, there she is. Hello? Oh, okay. She was waiting to change. All right. Sounds good. They're just going to go in separate taxis because they hate each other. No big deal. Boom. Perfect. We're home. Now, Lisa. Oh, shoot. She's standing right here. Her dad's probably like, what the actual... Yep, she's going to be scolded. I don't know what he's scolding her for. Probably because the house is messy. Oh my god. Or maybe it's because she's pregnant. She's grounded because she's pregnant. <laughs> so let's like beg for his forgiveness. I'm so sorry. It was a stupid mistake. Okay, I see that you're sorry. Just trying to behave in the future. You know, we'll try not to get pregnant in the future. Oh my god. Um, her mom needs to come talk to her. You know. Hug her. You know, let her know that you still love her, but you're kind of disappointed. Feel her tummy. I think she's crying. Nope, I don't know what she's doing. Judy, you're just so stupid. You just stand around and you act stupid and it's so annoying. She's going to go feel her daughter's tummy. Give her a hug. Because, yeah. Hug her. Aww. Alright, so I think everything's going to be okay. Her parents are kind of just like, whoa, kind of strange to come home from this. But I'm going to send everyone to bed. I'm sure that they're going to have be woken up when Lisa goes to have her baby. I don't know why everyone's not already in bed yet. Maybe they just wanted to stay up late and see their parents, I guess. I have no idea where VJ went. He's just, he's retarded. I don't know where he's at. Uh, and I think Ethan is the only good person who's actually asleep. He doesn't care to see his parents after they've been gone. So, yeah, I'm going to, I don't know when Lisa's exactly going to have her baby, but if I were to bet, I would say it would be in the middle of the night. So, I'm going to fast forward until either that or the morning. actually slept through the night she didn't have her baby last night which I know it's gonna happen today it has to she's really big whoo Arlo somehow got out of bed I said screw this he's sleeping in the tree house yeah not a very good night's sleep but he's gonna have to get up and go to school which kind of sucks for him um this part's gonna be a little longer just because I really oh what what are you doing Jack <laughs> He's, like, searching her computer, like, how could this have happened? Did the computer impregnate my baby girl? <laughs> um, but I don't really know what he's doing. He's being a creep. He has three days off, so, yeah, just get off. Get out of her room. I have... Ooh, school is canceled because the heavy snow good because the kids are, like, super exhausted. All right. 
where did VJ go? I asked him to stay the night, and he totally disappeared. But you know what? I don't even care. That guy's such a flag. I don't care. Really don't need him in our lives, do we? We do not. Um, but I see the mails here. So we probably need to pay the bills. We don't have enough money to pay the bills. That's what happens when you have a renovation in your house. You're not going to... You need to clean, Jack. Look at this kitchen. Just clean it. Clean it up. Please. What is he? He's going to scold. Oh, probably because the house is just like a huge mess. The biggest mess ever. Is Judy still in bed? She is still in bed. I really want Lisa to have her baby. What is this? What is this mess? What is this? I guess she's just holding on. Anyways, I'm going to have to end this part right here. So you guys are going to be left hanging on if Lisa's baby is going to be a boy or girl. You guys should comment down below what you think it's going to be, boy or girl, and leave some baby names for me so we can name him or her. I don't know what it's going to be. If you enjoyed watching this, please leave me a thumbs up. It takes one second and comment any suggestions you have down below. If you're new to my channel, I would really appreciate it if you would subscribe to me so you can get my new videos in your sub box. And I hope that all of you have an amazing day. I'm going to go enjoy the rain because we never get it. So, yeah. Love you guys. Have an amazing day. I'll talk to you in my next video. Bye, guys.